finally, finally made it. It took us over 24 hours to get here, um, but it was, it's so worth it. So we've already had a little dip in the pool, trip to the spa, I'm joking. Kai's just about to go and rent a moped. I think we'll probably just rent, uh, we'll probably just pay for the 30 days. The pool, oh my God. See, I hate going to pools because I don't like a feeling of like tiles and stuff. And the pool is concrete on the floor. So I don't even have to touch any tiles. Loving it. It's actually 5 p.m. already. Um, but the plan for today is just to go down to the beach. We've been told that the sun sets here about six o'clock. So we've come for dinner on the first night. That's mine. That's Kai's. So good nearly died on a moped. <laughs> the most traumatizing experience. And now we've got to go back on it to go home. Hi guys, so we are now back at the room. We've just been out for food. We went to this place called the Fat Mermaid. The message was quite Ursula. Oh. <laughs> no, she's not to person, isn't she? Oh my god, it was so good. 100 percent we'll be going back there. And then we took a little walk back and then paid for the moped and for the month. The mopeds cost us £44, which for 30 days, that's really good. Then we went on it to go to the shop to get some water because we bought this water, right? Where is it? Bought this, which neither of us read it. We just looked at it and went, oh yeah, that's definitely water. I don't know why. Like, that is the murkiest water I've ever seen if that's water. Yeah, it's fine. Like, it's rank. It's literally like... It's it's well, It's called Pokari Sweat. So that gives <laughs> you an idea of how it actually tastes. So we had to go back to the shop to get water but we went on the mopeds and i genuinely genuinely thought i was going to die because i know it was kai's first time but he wasn't very good no no you weren't very good i had no seat and you were he, pushing your head into my head i couldn't fucking see you he, he wasn't very good so so tired so i'm literally we're gonna go for a little dip in the pool then i'm gonna have a cold shower and literally just go to bed and pass out good morning everyone it is i would say bright and early but it's not so about 11 o'clock isn't it so, yeah. yeah about 11 o'clock um we did actually wake up at like 4 a.m to torrential rain but like we were like wide awake and we were like how the hell is it for like half four in the morning we literally feel like we need to get up so we went back to sleep and we woke up at like 10 like literally um so we've definitely had a very very good night's sleep we probably had 13 hours obviously i'm not looking the best okay, i think we're gonna have a bit of a beach day and then sort of see what's around us in the day we're just about to get on the moped so we should be luck we're not even far out but the waves are so crazy it's a beastie one <laughs> <laughs> so I'm going to talk about quietly because we're in like a public place but we've just been to the beach, spent the day on the beach, had some food, <laughs> had some food and now we've come to like this really nice beach club. I'll insert like a clip of it, it's probably one of the nicest places I've ever seen. This place is just unbelievable. I think we're going to get some lunch in a minute. I just can't believe how cheap everything is here. We're off again. Safety. Safety first. Hi guys. Trying to find like good lighting in this room is impossible because there's like no light. Um, so, <laughs> um, so we're actually just gonna go to where is it? Fins. Fins, not Tim's. Tim. Oh, we're just gonna head over to Fins now. Have some food and some drinks, but not that many drinks because we don't really want to drink that much while we're out here. We're both awful with like hangovers and stuff. And we're both, I'm not putting my helmet on. <laughs> Fishy. So 
we're currently in Finn's Beach Club. Oh my god, I've never seen anything like it. Yet. <laughs> we're definitely going to come back. Grace is actually going to come out and see us for a couple of weeks. So we're definitely going to bring her back here. And the food is so good. How good was the food? Unreal. Unreal. <laughs> okay, so I'm back home. Something very, very bad has happened. And it was my fault. We've managed to lock the key for the scooter inside the part that lifts up in the scooter. We can't move the scooter and now we can't reopen it. So basically Kai said to me, oh, pass me the keys. So pass him the keys, pass him the room key instead. And we hadn't actually closed the scooter properly. So we managed to open the, the bottom. And because the scooter was already open, we didn't notice. Because normally you need the, the scooter key to open the chair um and i just put my bag in there which had the actual moped key in it and then i closed it and the guy was like oh the key's not working and it turns out it was the wrong key now the guy was like oh i'll just have to go and get you a second key cut and we were like okay how long will that take and he was like i have no idea like maybe a few days and Kai was like, oh my god, no, we're gonna have no moped for a few days. I was like, Kai, the worst part is you shut your phone in there. Kai's phone is inside the moped and it will be for a few days. So he's actually had to hop on the back of the guy who's like in charge of all this. He's had to hop on his moped and they're gonna go down and try and see if they can do anything to open it. I'll keep you updated. So update, turns out Kai actually crashed the moped into a car and two other mopeds. This is the damage. Just for reference, this number plate is actually supposed to be on the front of the car. On the front of the moped. Yeah. Luckily, Kai is like completely okay. He's got no, not even a scratch on him. I do not know how. Um, good reflexes, the guy said. Oh yeah, the guy said he had good reflexes. The car needs three new panels because of like the scratches and dents. Luckily, we're in Bali and not the UK because it only cost us um, for the, to fix the two mopeds and the car £260, which is so good because there was quite a lot of damage to the, one yeah. of the mopeds, wasn't there? Like quite a lot. Back in the UK, you're talking about four grand. Yeah. As for our bike, it's going to cost us about 300, was it 360 or something? 330 yeah. pounds. So, I mean, it the whole situation really could have been a lot worse the main thing is kai's okay all of the drivers are okay i am not getting back on a moped and i also didn't realize that um we're not actually insured to drive them in this country which is something that we didn't know anyway so we ordered some food to celebrate <laughs> uh we're celebrating kai being okay tomorrow kai's gonna go with the guy to fix the bike at 8 a.m oh yeah they went to go and collect the moped off the side of the road and um he drove my bike back yeah he drove Kai's bike back and let Kai drive his bike. After he just saw me After fly into a car and two other bikes. Literally. So, I mean, if that doesn't prove that it happens all the time over here, I don't know what does. Good morning, everyone. The plane's left us both with like a sore throat and like a slotty nose and stuff. What about the altitude though? Kai has been this morning to take the bike and then he went to the shop. So for breakfast today, we have waffles and ice cream. With, oh my God, it's Oreo ice cream with like an Actimel kind of thing and some grapes. Oh my God, let me show you. So this is breakfast, which is gonna be done outside by the pool. Oh my God, that looks so good. I'm excited for this. We're just gonna be done out by the pool. We don't have a plate. <laughs> uh, or a spoon. I don't have four spoons. Did you? I think so. No, well, I did, I grabbed them. Yeah, we've got spoons. Okay, we've got spoons. We might just have to ask if they've got a plate or something. So this is our little breakfast. <laughs> Waffle, a little yogurt drink, some apple juice and some grapes. How cute. And the view. <coughs> mm, yummy. So I think we're just gonna have a little bit of a pool day today. Um, maybe go and do some yoga or something later. The bike is all fixed now thank god i think overall it's probably cost us about 500 pound in damages which is so much like this is like best case scenario like it could have gone so 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 much worse it's so hot today i think this is the hottest day so far isn't it yes. way hotter than yesterday so really really warm so here's the bike it's actually better than when we got it it's all brand new there brand new there 
so it's not even as good as new it's better than new hi guys about quarter past four um and we've just woke up so we actually did like a full body workout in the swimming pool i'm actually starting to feel quite ill um i'm a bit worried because i've got like mosquito bites all over me like this one look how swollen my hand is it's like so itchy and then i've got this one on my arm which is almost taken over my arm and that's really swollen as well and i've googled it and i mean i know you shouldn't google it but i googled it and they could be infected so might be a case of a trip to the doctor tomorrow morning i'm literally like covered i counted 18 it's day two I'm, i've got 18 bites this is a joke but hopefully everything's fine i'm sure it will be i'm sure i'm just being a drama queen as usual look at this got a little cookie cheese and bean jack potato in the water that's like a good potato it does it's banging so we're back down on the beach look how many surfers there are I don't even know if you can see properly, but they're just literally everywhere. I'm just gonna go and sit and watch the sunset um, and then probably go and get some dinner on the way home. We just met the cutest little dog. It was like the tiniest little dog. His name was Momo. Oh my God. this is me from the future um so i'm just editing this video back now and this next clip i don't know if i give it any context later on but basically kai lost his phone in the ocean it like snapped off the straps that we were using if you watch you can actually see the moment where he realizes that it's snapped off and he's like jumping up in a panic and like running over to me and i'm finding it hilarious so i've still put the clip in because it's so funny um but yeah just so you guys know what's going on in the next bit <laughs> <laughs> you avoided that one. Oh my god. managed to lose his phone in the ocean which is brilliant we do have insurance thank god so we've just been on the phone to loads of well our friends and family just letting them know <laughs> that i won't be able to answer because he's lost his phone in the sea his bank cards were in there so we've had to order new bank cards luckily we can get them to the address that we're staying in other than that we've just got to put a claim through the insurance because we are covered for loss accidental loss it's not the start that we expected, but it's both us. days were good, and then both evenings. Yeah, but it's us. So what can we expect? Yeah. just gonna get up now quickly get ready and go to new mexico and i think it's called lilo's two couples stopped and asked us for pictures so we thought like oh you want to take a picture of you no they wanted pictures with us it was crazy and i don't know whether it was because like maybe i'm so pale 
I know it sounds silly, but maybe I'm so pale. I've never seen somebody that pale before. Because like, we were actually on the beach the other day and the woman on the beach was saying, oh my God, your skin. You're so white, I want skin like yours and stuff like this. My outfit for tonight, just put a little purple dress on. You gonna do your outfit? It's not much, it's, it's not very special. It's not. Go on. Meditation. <laughs> We're just doing some grocery shopping. Such a big fruit and veg section. Mental. Guys, I know my hair's been like this like throughout the whole of the video, but this is the only way that I can like not suffocate. Also, another mosquito bite. Right, I'm up to 56. I've got 56 mosquito bites. We're just gonna go sit outside with our WKDs, like the cool kids. So one did offer me, the, the, the geezer that took me on the bike. Yeah. Him. He said, do you want some exercise? No, he didn't. I was like, I'll pass him on No. <clears throat> the guy on the bike? Do you offer you ecstasy? Huh? You offered me ecstasy? And I went on full. <laughs> yeah, we're just gonna go outside now, sit by the pool, play some cards, and have a few little drinky pops. <laughs> no, I'm not gonna say that. Have a little drink. No, I don't wanna say drinky pops. This literally just screams holiday vibes. So we got cranberry and grapefruit and exotic blue. And then the pool's just there. So cute. Playing a nice game of cards, and then the torrential rain kicked in. Brilliant. Everything's so good morning everyone. We actually well I should say good afternoon, it's about past eleven. We actually woke up today at eleven o'clock. So we're clearly still recovering from some sort of jet lag because we've never normally stay in bed that long. And I think we're gonna walk into the town. I need to go to a chemist because these bites are getting out of control. Um, I'm up to 60, 62 last time I counted. Sitting down to have some breakfast again. We've got Nutella and Oreo waffles with some lemon iced tea. Just it with the cool Lovely stuff. Hi guys, so we have had a bit of a mare this morning. Went to the chemist. It was very expensive for all the stuff, but they have given me two different types of tablets and some creams for the mosquito bite. So hopefully that will help. We're just on our way to go and do yoga now. Add another mare with my bank card. Just beware, if you come out, take a Monzo card, but also try and get like a Monzo business or a backup card, because clearly they're unreliable. We managed to use it yesterday, today, nothing's working. So can't get cash out, can't pay for anything. Um, so luckily I brought my Monzo business card and that's working, fingers crossed. So yeah, just be aware of that. If you guys do go abroad or anything, you, you're relying on one card, just make sure you have a backup. Oh wow, look at the sunset. Hi guys, so we've just finished the yoga session. It was just so amazing. We feel so relaxed now. So just taking a little walk on the beach to see the sunset. And then I think we're gonna go to the lawn where we went the other day for some food. Sorry for the lighting, it's not very bright outside. So I haven't actually vlogged much today because we haven't really done much. Today we, in the morning we sort of just like chilled, worked out what we actually want to do while we're here, like just made a few lists and things. And then we headed down to the beach and did some bodyboarding, which was so good. We're gonna go out for some dinner. There's actually a restaurant just around the corner from us. I can't remember what it's called now, but I'll show you in a sec. It's actually so cute. There's like a snake and ladders table. So we've just been using the keys and downloaded a dice app. And we've just been playing snakes and ladders. And of course I won. Oh my God, so I've got a jackfruit burger. Look how good that looks. <laughs> Look how good that looks. And Kai's got chicken. Chicken, sorry. 
I can't remember what it's called. called. But it's got like it's got parmesan amazing. and bacon on it. Looks amazing. Guys, I look really tired. Um, but we've had to get up super early this morning. I say super early, it's like half seven. <laughs> to go to a waterfall today. I'll leave the name of the waterfall on screen because I can't remember what it's called. I don't think I'd be able to pronounce it anyway. We've got a taxi box for eight o'clock just to take us straight to the waterfall. about the bad lighting it seems to be like a theme throughout this video but as i film like in the middle of the day there's no light anywhere today as you saw we went to the waterfall that was amazing okay, so for dinner tonight um we've got this egg fried rice which always comes with some sort of egg on top so this time we got a fried egg um and then kai ordered some butter uh, chicken or something no it was, a, it, was a, it was a salt and pepper one a oh, salt and pepper chicken with scrambled egg oh, um, and then we've got some sushi rolls. How good do they look? One's chicken and one's tuna. And this all came to £3.50. Guys, I know this is probably like the most random thing ever, but we've just eaten some Haribos. Out here they have yellow hearts. And that's nice. that's either a mangled yellow heart or some sort of like orange slice. I just thought that was so cool. I just had to turn this back and realize it didn't do an outro so um thank you so much for watching guys as you can see we had such a good time in our first week in bali hopefully my next vlog will be up on sunday i know it's tuesday today um but i'm hoping it's gonna be up on sunday this was supposed to be up on sunday but it just took me so long to edit my next vlog will be up on sunday thank you so much for watching and i'll see you then